The triplet rascado that's done with a thumb, fingers, thumb is probably the most exciting rascado that you see and it's definitely the one that I get asked to show the most. It's quite a bit nuanced, but it's actually not that hard. It's just one extra note added to the thumb fingers rascado with a slight twist. If you've already seen the introductory rascado video that I made of all nine rascados, then you remember that this triplet rascado looks like this. So let's break that down and add some exercises to make sure that you were doing this one correctly as well. To practice this movement correctly, you wanna make sure to break down each movement first and then start to combine them little by little, just like we did in the video that I made on the thumb up, fingers down, okay? So the first thing you wanna do is make sure that you're starting once again with the right amount of flexion in your wrist, not too much, not too little, just a little bit of flexion naturally. It should be pretty loose. Minimizing ulnar deviation, so this flexing, bending to the side. And of course, obviously if there's flexion, you're not gonna have any extension. So never any extension in the wrist, all right? Rest your arm, lower back straight, comfortable. Try not to hunch over at the neck or at the upper back. Just be relaxed, make sure your shoulders are relaxed, okay? So the first movement in this is up with the thumb. We're gonna extend with A and M or with M. You can decide which one you prefer. I use both and I would recommend practicing both, okay? For now, for this video, this demo, I'm gonna use A and M. This is a light flick with A and M. This is very important. Watch this. Make sure that when you flick, you're opening your hand a little bit, right? So see how my thumb actually goes up when I open my hand? So, right? I'm not doing this. So not, my thumb isn't going down. I wanna make sure my thumb goes up so it stays above the E string, right? Notice from this angle, I'm not extending all the way. So just a little bit of extension, open up the hand a little bit and you're good to go. That's the second movement. After that movement, we've got the downward movement with the thumb. So we just did this. Now we're gonna go down with the thumb with forearm rotation, just like we talked about in the video that, uh, that I made on the thumb strumming and on the thumb up and fingers down strumming. So thumb down, lightly, using forearm rotation. So make sure you're not doing this. Forearm rotation, right? Be very, very light on the strings. If you do try to do this too hard, your fingers nail is gonna get stuck. It's gonna, you might bust a nail. It's just gonna feel uncomfortable. So stay super, super light. Think about brushing up against the strings rather than plucking the strings or even strumming them. Think about brushing, okay? So those are the individual movements. Let's practice each of them first, starting with the upstroke of the thumb. We're just gonna do these twice. Okay, so like that. So it's gonna, I'm gonna count to three. We're gonna do it on three. So one, so on the one of every three. So one, two, three, up. One, two, three, up. Hold that position. Now we're gonna do the extension of A and M. Again, I would recommend practicing it with M as well. Same thing, one, two, three, flick. One, two, three, flick. Make sure you're opening the hand and not extending too much, okay? Last one, downstroke of the thumb. One, two, three, rotation. One, two, three, rotation. Now let's combine. Next exercise, we're gonna combine each pair. So it's gonna be thumb up, fingers flick, okay? One, two, three, thumb flick. One, two, three, thumb flick, okay? Next, we're gonna start with the flicking of the fingers and the downstroke of the thumb. So one, two, three, flick, thumb. One, two, three, flick, thumb. Okay, and the last one, we're gonna do the thumb, the thumb down and thumb up. So we're in this position, right? One, two, three, thumb down, thumb up. One, two, three, thumb down, thumb up. And the next one, the final part of this exercise is to combine all three. So we're gonna go thumb, flick, thumb, okay? Thumb up, fingers flick, thumb down. One, two, three, thumb, flick, thumb. One, two, three, thumb, flick, thumb. Let's go a little bit faster. So it's gonna be one, two, three, thumb, flick, thumb. One, two, three, thumb, flick, thumb. A little faster. One, two, three, one. One, two, three, one. One, two, three. 
a little bit faster. One, two, three, one, one, two, three, one, one, two, three, one, two, three, one. Okay? As you get faster, you can add more notes to it. So instead of just three, you can add the fourth one, which is the beginning of the next rotation, right? And then... Etc. Right? Eventually, we'll get it up to there, okay? And if you like this video, then of course you're going to want to check out the next one in the series here, where I talk about a variation of this triplet rasqueado, where I show you P, C, I, or P, A, I rasqueado. 